How's it what it do everybody? It's your boy Nocturne and we are here with Death's Door. This came out today or yesterday. I mean, this recording is probably not going to be out on the day of release, but it basically is brand new. It just came out. Uh, it looks like it was, it's like a roguelike kind of dungeon crawling game, except you play as a crow trying to go kill people who've outlived uh, their life, I guess. Something like that. I only briefly read the description. My buddy Rob actually recommended this to me and um i like the art style and what i saw from the gameplay so much i just straight up bought it so we're gonna get into it oh uh, sure let's start this up i also just got uh finished recording episode two of yumi nikki so sorry if i seemed a bit drained and a little less talkative through this now arriving at reaping commission headquarters sharon the bus drive already. end of the line Oh, look at us. Little crow boy. Oh, I have a bow and arrow, too? Okay. See, I really like the art style. Oh, okay. It's my dodge. It seems like I can just do that infinitely. No one seems to be around. Oh, hey there. Uh, ball plart. Ball plart. Okay. <laughs> Head of security. If you guys don't know, okay, I shouldn't have to explain this, but obviously, like Paul Blart, the mall cop thing. Yeah, you're clear. Move it along, bud. Uh. Oh, okay. I guess I'm good. There was a big X, but uh, I guess I'm okay. Hall of Doors, Reaping Commission headquarters. Uh. Okay. Is this the person who made this place? Because I've been seeing posters of them around. I guess let's go this way. I like the music too, so far. Okay. Well, well, well. Chandler the Handler. Look who showed up for work. No worms for you. Because only the early bird catches... Never mind. Anyway, it's your lucky day. I actually have a soul for you to reap. And not just any soul, a giant soul. Think of the commission on that. I hope you haven't forgotten your training. Stay on your talons. Giant souls don't often co go peacefully. Dropping in your door for you now. Dropping in my door? Alright, cool. <laughs> With a soul that size, you might even be able to afford some time off. But remember... Your door will remain open until you return with your designated soul. While your door is open, you will be mortal, and you will age, so get it done quickly. Reaping souls to power the doors, just so we can reap more souls. The cycle repeats forever. The rat race, eh? Anyway, get to it, and be careful. If you die, it's gonna be a lot of paperwork, and I don't have the time. Well, alright, Chandler the Handler, uh... So, I become mortal as long as my door is open. Darwin the ball keeper. He a uh, sleepy boy. So, who's this person? Agatha the typist. Oh boy, I love typing. Can't get enough of it. Alright, well, I'm glad you found the profession that suits you. Uh, me, I guess I reap souls from things. Because I'm a crow. Because, yeah. I guess we're just jumping straight into it. Alright. I'm assuming it's like your typical... Oh yeah, so when- he said I age, too, so... I wonder if that's gonna- Yeah, I figured out how to roll. This might- That's fast. That's fa it's like, instant. Uh... Oh, so you're- you're friendly? Okay. Alright, sorry, um... Alright, cool. Where's my... Okay, that doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. Oh, I can free my camera. Now my other buttons seem to do anything right now. But they'll probably get to that. Oh? What are you guys doing? Okay. Oh! Oh, hold L2... Or not L, well, basically L2 will be, okay. Wait, why can't, it's not working. 
Do I need you guys to be up there with me? Do I shoot them? That'd be a little silly, but no. <laughs> you guys are so cute, but I can't get my bow to work. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Now it works. Oh, that is not... Uh... Okay, how do I shoot? <laughs> how do I shoot my arrow? I got this far to get it to work. I didn't shoot my arrow, but, uh... Okay, um... Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I figured it out now. Finally, jeez. <laughs> Shortcut, y'all. Probably age a lot. Oh, we're just jumping right into this. Hello. Demonic forest spirit. Okay. Ow. Oh. Uh, I don't like that. Okay. And we can't see the health bar, but I'm assuming with how much it's cracking, we're almost there. Oh, that doesn't look good. Easy enough. Oh. Oh, ow. All right, there we go. <laughs> My little crow man, he's so happy. Look at all the little plant things. Oh. Uh, did I die? Oh no. Someone just came in and yoinked my giant soul. Oh, I'm not dead, okay. Thanks, old guys. I'm just gonna call you all Phils. You're all Phil. You're Phil, you're Phil, you're Phil, and you're Phil. Alright, I love you, Phils. Alright, uh, <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. But who just yoinked my giant soul? What a turd. <laughs> I worked hard for that, man. Birds gotta eat, you know? Lost Cemetery, Forbidden Region. Okay. Yoink. I wonder if there's like different weapon. There it has to. Oh. Oi. Hey. Yeah, you. You took my freaking soul. Yeah, you. Hey, get back here. Give me my soul. Mm. Alright. I'll just have to deal with you in a little bit. What's over here? Oh. Okay. Oh, what is this? I collected a life seed. Planting one of these in a green pot will yield soul fruit, which can be consumed to restore your health. A pot? So I can only heal if I find a pot and if I have a soul seed. Interesting. Okay. Well, let's try and find a pot, because I am missing some health. Nothing that way. Weird looking creatures. Which is cool. I like them. They look cool. Creepy, but... Hey, you. Oh. Doesn't... Maybe I shouldn't have killed him. He seemed pretty friendly, but... Uh, I need a key. No, I can just activate it. Is this gonna take me back? I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay. Ah, okay. Little crow, do I sense a glut of soul energy? Come here, and you can trade in those souls to gain an edge in combat. Okay, so he's how I do my upgrade trees and stuff. Almost down there. Okay, that looks interesting. We'll go down there in a second. Hello, Darwin. Welcome to the Soul Vault. Would you like to increase your combat skills? 
Ah, the Reaper's ability to wield melee weapons. So I'm just known as the Reaper. Attack and speed, speed, grace of move. So movement, magical power. So the bow counts as magic. I don't have enough to increase any of that. Okay, let's go over here. Let's see what that was about. Oh, you're new. Hello. Oops. <laughs> Badger the Reaper. Oof. You lost your assignment? That's rough, buddy. <laughs> it's been so quiet the past few years. Advances in medicine or something? I, I expect. So annoying. We need, a, we need a new plague. I'm gonna go broke. I mean, there is... Uh, uh, hmm. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> Okay, I don't have... So in order to get back there, I'll need like a bomb or something. We need a new plague. Uh, have you been to Earth? I'm not sure if we're on Earth, but... Oh no. You've lost your assigned soul? That's the one thing we didn't want to happen. Well, uh, get back out there and don't come back until you've found it. Alright, alright. I'll go look for the person who stole my soul. Like, I just saw them, so... Oh, traveling here restored my health. Cool. Hello, I'm back. Did you miss me? Killing... Oh. What is this? Mass of soul energy. Soul energy can be spent... I just came from there. I probably need fire for that. Yeah, I really like this so far. It has a unique art style and everything. I'm, I'm just gonna kill these guys because they seem littered around. I get souls from them, so why not, right? Uh, these guys. Yeah, so those are aggro on sight. All right. Oh, here's a planter. Well, I don't need health now, so I'll probably just save it. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> Alright, yeah, sorry I'm not really saying much. What's this do? I got a key. Some sort. Ooh, more soul energy. We'll always take more. Anything under here? No. Yeah, like I said, I just got done recording an episode of Yumi Nikki, so my brain is a little fried. This way to the summit. Well, it's blocked off, and the way I came from yielded nothing. Oh, I have a key for this gate now. All right. Hey, buddy, I know I, I, know I just killed you before, but <laughs> I just want your soul essence now. Do do do. Oh. All right. I like this enemy type, but like, what the heck? Okay, so those I can just easily eat. Ow. Okay, that was not worth the trade. Oh, there's a plant here, so I'll probably just do... Oh. Oh, they can hurt each other. Okay, I like that. Oh. Ah, I couldn't move. The freaking mask is in the way. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh, I'm gonna plant that seed now. Oh. Hey there, I'll consume that, thank you. I don't know if that would full heal me or if that's only like two of my health bars, which is what I restored, but hey, I did it. Maybe I could have saved that seed, but we'll never know. We'll just keep going. Uh, I want to go up here. This looks pretty. Even though it's a cemetery. <laughs> yeah, I really like the art style that this game has. Oh, hello. You have a tombstone on your head. Steed Hone the Gravedigger. Ah, oh, a reaper. My time in this world is over. Uh. Okay. Oof. I didn't actually mean to do that. Hmm. Unfortunately, I'm still alive. Oh, sorry. Maybe try hitting me with a harder attack. Why do I have to kill him? He seems so... I guess... Hmm. 
No, still here and still very much alive. Perhaps try a bit of a run up. Wait, I can run. Roll with A and pre. Okay. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. It happens to everyone. I'm afraid I am burdened with unending life. I can't explain it, and I have spent untold years seeking an answer. My name is Stedhoden. I am the keeper of graves on this sacred mountain. Oh, and if you do find yourself strengthened somehow, feel free to try and kill me again. Okay, well at least you moved out of my way. I mean, you seem so cool though. I'm sorry that you outlived your, uh, your, uh, not your purpose, but just, you outlived, as, you lived longer than you wanted to. I'm sorry. Alright, what's in here? <laughs> Ooh, I want to get over there. I want to see, like, what all the different, like, weapons and stuff are like in this game. Oh, I can just fall off. Okay. And it's like, where am I? Okay, that didn't really seem to do anything. This way to the stranded sailor. Stranded sailor? Uh, I'm assuming I need a magic item or power up to get through there. Let's go back down here. As I roll around at the speed of sound. This way to the summit. Oh wait, this is where I saw the bird. I'm coming for you, man. You're gonna regret taking my soul. I feel like I'm playing Zelda, just <laughs> constantly rolling every five seconds. Okay, well, there's a life seed, so I'm gonna grab that real quick. But what's down here? Ah, uh, oh wait, oh that's a shortcut to. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So yeah, this is the way I need to go. <laughs> All right, big bird man, your time has come. Ooh, what if there's something behind here? Hello? Aha, see, there was like a trail right here, so I was like, th there's something back there. Hello? Anyone see any big bird? Oh, that's a big bird, but not the one I'm looking for. Print shrine. Let's see what this does. The ancient shrine offers you a shard from the vitality crystal. Collecting four will raise your vitality beyond its limits. Cool. <laughs> so I wonder what my max health can be like. And I'm assuming there's enemies that can do like two of my health in one hit. Eventually. Alright. Wait, wait, what if I... Okay, yeah, I, I need like a bomb or something for that. Mm, yeah. Ki <laughs> He doesn't even know it yet. Oh, another life seed down there. Okay. I wonder if life seeds carry through doors. Like through areas. Key. Key. Woo! Sorry, I know you're having fun. Pick that up. Uh, oh, that's a big door. Yeah, you know, that's probably where Birdman went. We'll see what's over here. Ooh. Ooh, but that also... Okay, we'll go look at the big door, because that looks like that'll be like a mini boss or a boss arena. Whee! Will this open? Oh, wait, there's a whole bridge here. Oh, that's above. Okay. So I couldn't interact with the door. I don't think there's anything here. Yeah. Alright. So we do have to go that way. I know some of them are different colors. I wonder if that means anything. Alright. I don't need the planter. Yeah, okay, so wait. Oh, you're a new enemy. Did I deflect that? I 
I guess I'll have to try it. Alright, yeah, you can. Oops, wrong button. Nah, I don't need to use that. Oh, that was not worth the trade. Ow. Alright, alright. Oh, I didn't charge it up long enough. I need to go restore my health. Okay, so that does full heal me. I was just spamming. I'm like, I don't know when he's going to shoot it. Oh, look at all the bloodshed. That's probably where I need to go. I want to see what's down here. I could have played that so much better, but I just didn't. Oh, is this just another... Another place I could have taken the battle. All right. All right, Mr. Birdman, I know you're up here. Show yourself. Oh, shortcut. Cool, cool. All right, let's do this. You're not the bird, man. I have to fight a freaking mini castle? Guardian of the door. All right, let's go. Okay. We're just gonna stick to range for a second until I... Okay. Woo! Okay. Oh, jeez, okay. I'm pretty comfortable with your moveset now. Oh, what's he doing? Oh, no. All right. Cool. Laser beam attack. Woo! And he shoots me. Ow. Looks like he's almost dead. Oh, I can't actually get near him when he does that. How do I regenerate arrows? Oh, I have to hit them. It's like Hyper Light Drifter. Okay. Whew. Yeah. Easy. Zero deaths. Zero death run. Let's go. I can't dance, but... I can't T-pose on your corpse either, but, uh... <laughs> Why am I so stupid? Okay, let's, let's keep going. What's over here? There's an elevator. This way to the summit. So we keep going to the summit. This way to the overgrown ruins. Well, I can't actually get over there. Guess we're going to the summit. Uh, okay, there's a lever here. For that. I don't remember seeing that area. And there's things up there. Okay, well, we'll go through here first. Where's that go? There's already blood there, so it's like I've been there before. Oh. oh! Oh, oh, okay. So this is just another shortcut. Gotcha, gotcha. Alright, so that's what that was for. 
Yeah, I really like the music to this. How am I supposed to get there? Oh, if that's like a teleportation pad, so I need to like, I don't know, find something to turn it on or activate it. And I need to find a way to get this key. Which I'm assuming is over here. Oh, what is that? Hello. You found some incense. This stuff smells very strong. What does that do? Shiny things. And incense, you blah blah blah. The way we'll decide for you. <laughs> okay. Cool. Are these just collectibles, I guess? Oh, weapon. Oh, there's only like five weapons. Okay. Alright. I got some incense, I guess. I got some shiny incense. Doesn't help me with this key, but I'm assuming I just need to go further ahead. Hey! Hey, you! That's my soul, man! What were you doing? I earned that! Bruh. Grey Crow. Oh, hello, fledgling. Sorry about the crack on the head, but... I needed that soul. Yeah, I needed it too. You see, I was a reaper, just like you. Years ago, my assignment evaded capture. It took many months to track it down to this location. Upon arrival, I discovered it had somehow passed through this door. Inconceivable. Do you know where we are, Fletchling? Uh, the summit, from what all the signs said. Death's door. Roll credits! Uh -huh. The end point for all life. I thought it was just a legend. As you know, all doors are powered by the energy of souls. Perhaps with a truly monumental amount of power, even this one could be forced open. Sadly, the soul I stole from you was not enough. I'm afraid that our fates are very much intertwined now, Fletchling. For with your assignment incomplete, your death is now an inevitability. Yeah, thanks, asshole. Without the soul that now resides behind this door, you are trapped, just like me. However, fortune may still smile upon us. This cursed land is hidden to the Reapers, somehow untouched by the laws of nature. The creatures here have the potential to live vastly beyond their years, growing ever larger and more powerful. I know of three such beings on these isles whose combined soul energy could grant us the power to wedge this door open. To the north lives an old witch obsessed with escaping the clutches of death. Beyond the forest to the east, a self-proclaimed king rules over the ruins of a flooded cathedral. And atop the mountain to the west, a beast of untold years, primal and vicious, with no want or desire. I am truly sorry to have entangled you, Fledgling, but in my advanced years, my body, my body grows weary. Your path is your own now. Either venture into the wilds and reap those giant souls, or choose inaction and suffer the same fate as this old fool. You're an asshole, you know that? Do you wish for guidance on where to head next? Oh, I suggest you head north. There lives an old witch. Alright, so I guess I need to go to the witch first. Freaking took my soul. Trying to... Oh, oh. Thank you. Thank you very much. Trying to freaking open up your door. I needed that. <laughs> but alright. We'll keep going. Can't seem to open that without another key. Is there anything over here? Nothing. Alright. Alright, I'm actually almost out of time for this, but we're just gonna keep exploring a little longer. I think that's. I think I went through that area, yeah. This way to the Urn Witch's Man. Yeah, let's go! Oh! It's just right here! I, did, <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Alright. Well, now we definitely have to keep going. Uh, hello. Which I'm here to kill you because some old freaking crow took my soul 
that I earned and tried to use it because he was like, oh, legend tells of blah, 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 blah. Death's door, blah, 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 blah. Stinky. Okay. But what did that do, though? Put that up, so let's go back this way. <laughs> Ooh, a spooderling. He did. He done died, done did. Oh, does this just open the way? Yeah, alright. Uh, elevator? Cool. Nice elevator design, I like it. Oh, pretty place you got here. I guess this goes outside. So, that wasn't actually the dungeon. <laughs> See, now I just feel stupid. Of course that wasn't the dungeon. But then again, how was I supposed to know? Uh, another life seed. We'll gladly take those. Yeah. Can I kill these bushes? Dang. Uh, hello? Any water serpents gonna come through the water well? Is there gonna be a ghostly hand asking for toilet paper? I can't even jump into the well. Sad. Zero out of ten. Never play. No, I'm kidding. Uh, can I light the other thing on fire by sh oops, by shooting an arrow? Heck yeah. What does this say? Burn your weapons and spread joy. I mean, yeah, that's what I did. Can I set things on fire? Oops. I keep doing that. No, okay. Cannot set the tree on fire. Yeah. And the state of the urn witch. North of the door. So, okay, this seems like it's the dungeon. And these are here so I can restore my, uh, my projectiles. God, my freaking nose keeps itching. Ah, I hate it. A puddle. Well, no splash effects, but that's fine. Maybe it wasn't a puddle. <laughs> what you say? This way to the Urn Witch's Mansion. All right. Hello, what do we have here? Can I swim? No, I cannot. That is a big no. <laughs> uh, oh, sweet. I mean, that's a pretty good place to stop, if I do say so myself. There's a weird guy. You know what? We're going to fight this guy first. Or talk to him. Oh, hello there, my big-faced fellow. It is quite unusual to see one of your kind upon these isles. I imagine you must be here for a soul. Not me, I should hope. Anyway, it seems our paths have intersected at an opportune moment. You may not have noticed, but I have been cursed with an unusual affliction. The pot is your head? Alas! Judge me not by the shape of my head, but by the deliciousness of the soup inside. Uh, pothead. All right, cool. Nice name. Uh, where are my manners? I'm very pleased to make your acquaintance, Beakface. That is Reaper Beakface to you? <laughs> it would seem that my journey has reached an impasse. I haven't been able to overcome the obstacles ahead and unlock the iron gates. If you would help me move on, I should be indebted to you, and we could push forward together. This guy gives me, like, heavy Siegward vibes from my... Dark Souls. Siegward or Siegmeier. But yeah, so that's a good place to stop because I am running out of time. Um, I'm definitely going to keep playing this. This is like, uh, it kind of reminds me a little bit, like not a whole lot of like Zelda, but it's almost like a Zelda roguelike in how it just plays, you know? I don't know if you like know what I mean, but that's how it comes off. Does it autosave? I don't. I don't know if it auto saves. Uh. Uh. Where do I save? Oh yeah. 
I'm not sorting out the paperwork for this, so you'd better fix your own mess. Okay, thanks for helping me, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's really cool. It's really fun. I really enjoy the music. Uh, I haven't gotten in to like too much of the combat, but I'm sure that like the weapons are gonna. Oh, hello. I found a discarded umbrella. It's just a thing to keep your feathers dry in grim weather. You can equip it from. This is a weapon. Where are the stats? Uh, does less damage. So this is just a meme weapon. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, well, I found my first weapon. Huzzah. But, uh, yeah, it's really fun, honestly. Like, I could probably play this for a few hours. I don't know if there's, like, um... I'm assuming there's an ending considering I have to find three giant souls to open Death's Door. Or to hopefully open Death's Door. But yeah, I'll definitely keep playing this. I don't know if I'm going to make another episode about it. We'll see in the future, but, um, I, I'm running out of things to really say. Uh, um, it plays pretty smoothly, too. Like, combat doesn't feel clunky at all. Combat feels really smooth. I'm just enjoying it so far. I, I can't think of anything else to say. I can't think of any, like, constructive criticism. Like, it's good. I, I'm enjoying it, so, yeah. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe, comment, or do whatever, and I will see you next time.